Everybody, Baloney Panda here with a new Let's Play. We're gonna play Legends of Dawn. This is a completely blind run. I haven't played or done anything with this game. Uh, I just set my video. All I did is go to settings. Set my video, my audio, my controls. I don't think this has... Um, gamepad support? I haven't tried. Like, all the key bindings are keyboards on. Um, guessing there's not. Language is English, voiceover language. Um, is there subtitles before we start? Doesn't look like it, so back to main menu. Let's go for a new game. Choose a character, Shine. Now we want to create a new character. Human, Elf, Danian. Oh, whoa, well, it's human. Balonius is human. That's. Nuts. Ooh. We have 15 points. Uh, let's go for a that's dirty type character with some charisma, intelligence, two vitality, and two strength. <laughs> Again, I don't know how this game works. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm um, just usually in RPGs. I like to play a thief or dagger type of character, so that's why I got the dirty high. Well, let's see how ha what happens. That's hair. That hair looks horrible. Can we rotate? Yeah, it's actually like that. Let's let's get Bolognia's white hair. Is there like a whiter white? No. Looks kind of black, to be honest. Huh. I don't like that hair. Huh. Let's not play too much around with this. That's just random hair. Close my eyes, swing it around. There. I right know. There. Okay, that's gonna be the hair. Skin color. Let's just keep them light. Let's choose your name. It's gonna be Bolonius. Hey. Huh. Easier. Let's play normal, just because I know nothing of this game. I usually like playing on harder difficulties, but I don't know how that's gonna make this, these videos come out. I hope I didn't fuck up the video settings. I set everything to high, like grass movement, shadow, dynamic shadows. So I don't know how the performance is gonna be. I'll tweak everything after the first video. I just wanted to go into this completely blind. <coughs> let you accompany me any further. You've come too far as it is, and I could never forgive myself if harm should befall you on my account. I understand youth and the eagerness to prove oneself, but someday, hopefully, you will thank me. By the time you received this letter, we would have reached Corden's Fall, a village in the far north on the shores of River Arno. The wild region was, until recently, a battlefield. The stage where we defeated the Dwarven clans. There are some elven settlements in the district, so you can infer the complexity of the situation. Peace is fragile and very vital to our interests because of the mines that supply our kingdom with silver, gold, and other precious stones. I'm unfamiliar with the intricacies of local politics, but I know the ownership of the mines recently changed hands. The mine previously belonged to the Cordellis family, but is now owned by the North Trade Guild. You have met the noble Cordelluses and know of their great influence in court, yet they simply relinquish their major asset. Your duty is to find out why. We are heading further north to evaluate the current state of the mines. The horses and equipment are under your care to our return. Familiarize yourself with the surroundings and the villagers. Remember, you are a soldier of the Royal Guards and must comport yourself with dignity, even though you only answer to me. I hope you found the money I left for you to buy food. Best of luck, my cherished one. 
So that's the intro to the game. Again, I'm going to. I was thinking of. I was gonna read everything out loud, but since the game already reads it, I don't think I should go through with that. I just want to escape and audio. Can I? Yeah, I want to lower the music. I don't know. I thought there was there would be a dialogue version. Use the mining skill to mine all or different metals can be used to manufacture stronger weapons and armors. Okay, so we move with the WASD. Okay, that's good. How about this guy? Royal Guard. Did you sleep well? Your guardian, Sir Herkin Salavan, has left to investigate those strange things going on around the village, and he told me to welcome you. Um, First, yeah, where should I start? Stuff. It's in a crate on the ship. Then come back to me. All right, let's go to the ship. I don't know what just happened. Uh, we. Uh, it seems like I moved the camera by holding the right button and rotating. I don't know if I can rotate in another angle for now. Oh, here's the ship, though. Like, the camera doesn't auto-rotate, so I'm holding down the mouse button as I, I move. I hope that's not too annoying. That ship looks promising. Gotta find a sword, food, and potions for health. Okay, so this makes to me reading not as annoying since you guys can just listen to the dialogue. I'll just shut up so you can listen to it. If, if you guys just want to read it or skip ahead, you can just, well, there's the little bar at the bottom that you can fast forward through. It's like we have a weapon here. A grab all. Okay. Where do we put the weapon? In our hand, we got some Merkle tea, some apples, Elven, Altana's tea. Can we see what stuff does? No? Okay, so we'll talk to this guy again, Thank our you. hero, Bolognius. You can Very good. Beer now. Continue. It's a custom in these lands for a guest to treat the host. <laughs> Why not? Where the can I get it? Village salad. You'll see that some traders belong to the North Trading Guild, and others are independent. Their prices may differ depending on what terms you're on with the Guild. The Inn is the best place for a good drink. Okay. So... Do we have a quest log? Buy beer. I'll treat this sailor with a beer. There are supposed to be traders in the village, so I'll take a look at their selections. So, this is the famous Cordon's Fall, the small village with a big reputation. Everyone wants a chance at the wealth to be had from their mines. Huh. Money can't make this autumn gloom go away. I need to get out of here before the first snow. Alright. Some dialogue from our character. So far, the game looks okay. It makes me feel like I'm playing Neverwinter. Not the UI, just the uh, the graphics and the way Greedy everything's assigned. The North Trade Guild. While we bleed, they profit from the war and now have an empire within the empire. Nevertheless, doing them some favors could result in good deals. Yeah, sounds good. Since our characters got some charisma to them, but we want to find the inn. Ooh, we can see inside the houses. That's cool. So far, I don't like the that I can't rotate the camera in another axis. Like, oh, there's gotta be a way. Movement, camera control, zoom in, zoom out, reset the camera. No, that's not what I want. I don't know. Gotta find the inn. Buy some beer. So far, the camera, I'm not a fan of. Oh, 
I'll get stuck there. Can we jump? Doesn't look like it. Who's this guy? Ah, hello stranger, welcome to Corden's Fall. How may I be of service? Nothing. A merchant? Can she sell us some beer? We are looking for beer, aren't we? Yeah. We only have two coins, so... Do we have a map? Can we open a map? What are you map? staring at, sailor? If you have something to say, spit it out. Maybe if I break the ice, I'll get a message from my father. Um, what the fuck was that? Was that this guy? Hello! Oh, we can search crates. Got rune stones, turquoise dye, wooden shield. I'll take a wooden shield. Fuck, just laying around. Loot that shit. Oh yeah! Greetings, fellow sailor! I'm not a sailor, I think you're drunk. Ha, you seem to be possessed by spirits of cheap wine. Hey. Sailor. Can you get us a drink? Wally Wally. <laughs> I am a complete stranger to you and you are already demanding favors. First you mistook me for a sailor, then a waiter. I am a soldier of the Royal Guard. You are a server. Sober up and I'll, or I will report you. Yes. Sober up, dude. He doesn't like me anymore. Bless you. He just burps in my face. Man, if I'm a member of the Royal Guard, I smash his face in. Burping in my face. Can we... Is this stealing or can we actually like loot this shit? Hello there, need something? What are you looking at? Doesn't seem like we got in trouble for like stealing, so... Oh hell, let's just go to town. Got a simple robe. Looks like a female armor. Yeah, not usable by males. We'll just take it. We might find someone to sell it and buy some beer. Beer's good, beer's good. No. So far, not a fan of the controllers. Ooh, that's shining. There's a bunch of keys. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, but there's a bunch of keys there. And no one's told me anything about stealing yet, so... Gimme, gimme, gimme. What is this? Holy crap, I am not reading all that. Fuck that. <laughs> I'm going to that building over there. Oh, there's... We don't want to see anything but at the inn. Well, let's just walk around, see if we can find it. I don't know, so far, I don't know what to say about this game. I don't want to reach the half hour mark and not know what the hell's going on. Here's a little market kind of place. But this is the, this should be the end since I took off all the markers. Now stop twisting my camera like that. Thank you. Open the door, walk in. This chick should have some beer for us. Show me what you have for sale. Um, let's. Can we sell? Yeah, we can sell. I don't want to double add. Keys. I have 32 copper, and the ale is like two silver. I can't buy that. Buy. Yeah, I can't buy that.
Ah. Who wants ale? Fuck, do we actually gotta go and like steal shit and then sell it? Can we just get some beer off of this? Yeah, I want some beer. Cool. So, you need more money. I think that might have cost us all our money. <laughs> I don't know. Inventory? Alright, we still got 12. Wow, look at that. The town center even has its own fountain. Fancy. Aha! Merchants, too. They're usually full of useful information. Ah. Gonna question them later. Marquee Getting a Cordelis, little framey. The famous blue-blooded warrior, now a pathetic old man. Seems like he's lost control over the mines the king gave his family as a reward for their victory over the dwarves. Okay. I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, I'm definitely going the wrong way. I need to go back to the docks and give that guy some some beer. Whoa. Some things just popped in, like, randomly. Still hating this camera angle. See if we can find the docks and give the guy some beer and keep doing quests because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing so I'm just gonna follow the quests. Yeah, it's not this way. Not that way, buddy. Water looks pretty. Yeah, I'll take a look at the frame rate from the video and then tweak my settings so I don't... Creatures change their behavior during the night and some creatures are nocturnal only. We were when traveling after dark. Many places hide unknown dangers after sunset. If you must travel after sunset, be careful and heavily armed. Okay. That's not the guy. That's this is not even the right dog. The fuck? <laughs> I think we're like fifteen minutes in and I haven't accomplished anything. Seek merchants and they will buy almost anything you find on your journey. Use the gold to buy more expensive equipment. It, it can mean difference between life and death in the wilderness. Villages are protected by guards. If you are in danger or wounded, head for the nearest town. Patrolling guards will protect you. Great. Very I good. Some, but I guess you're on duty. Look around the village and meet people while you wait for Sir Salivan to return from his mission. More bad news for us these days. The mine in the outskirts isn't the only one with problems. I hope you sharpen your sword, because there's work to be done here in Cordon's Fall. My friends tell what me the problems? monster infestation around the village is larger than we thought. A tiny white spider is camped near the gate to the southeast. You're a royal guard. Go there and defeat it. Just remember these I'm things. ready for the task. Left click to attack. At the moment you have no magic or talent in the quick bar, you must defeat him with a cold weapon. Click on a dead body. They glow yellow to see items dropped by your enemies. Pick items up in your inventory. If your health gets low, use a healing potion if you have one. Or run away. You'll heal slowly over time. Okay. That's handy. So we got a new quest. Practice. Tiny white spiders. Those monsters are the easiest you can find here. So easy. It's so easy you can defeat them. The one I need can be found southeast of the village outskirts. That's to the eastern gate. So we want to go east. East is this way. I think east is that way. Do we have a compass? No. <laughs> yeah. West. East, right? West? East? <laughs> oh, I'd be a bad navigator. For sure. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a little overwhelmed by the NPC interactions, so I'm just gonna stick to my quest. When I'm more familiar with the game, I'll start Talking to people, seeing what's going on. 
I don't know, there's the house out here. I'm guessing this is the eastern... That's it? No, this is... That's north. This should be the eastern that's it down here. Oh boy. Taking my sweet time. What's this say? Some creatures... Some creatures travel in packs. Strongest... Strongest of them usually has special skills or attacks. It is wise to separate him from the rest of the pack and kill him first. Okay. Camera, stop being so wonky. Soul quests. Some are very easy and you will get rewards that will help you in your journey. Items can be hidden in many places from chests, cargo boxes, barrels, and tree trunks. Carefully explore everything. Okay, so... We're leaving town. To the southeast, we gotta kill some spiders. There's a spider. Miss. We keep clicking, or is it an auto attack? No, we gotta click every attack. Okay, that did no damage to us. No glowing bodies means no loot, I think. Skill too low, you need higher mining to mine this rock. I killed one spider. You need a white spider though. There's something here. New spawn, a spawn point. Oh, I guess, I guess you can die in this game and just come back. Flower, flower blooms only at dawn. You cannot harvest it at any other time. I don't know, I'm gonna keep following the road. Gordon's Fall Cemetery. I feel like this isn't a good idea. What's here? Dwarven Chronicles. Caught signs, legendary items. Um. Looks like there's nothing there. Is it southeast? Of southeast. I killed a spider. Was that it? No, it's still active. Oh, fuck, I'm I'm sure I don't have to go to the cemetery. Like cemetery. This is the southeast. There's another spider. Actually hit me this time. It's actually hitting me a lot. Gain 30 experience. Nothing that doesn't complete my quest either. Maybe there's something up there? Can I jump? Is there a jump button? I'm confused. This game's confusing me. <laughs> no, it doesn't look like there's a jump. Add straws your weapon. I don't know, man. I'm gonna go to, to the cemetery. I'm. Gordon's Fall. Gordon's Fall Cemetery. 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 Why do I keep saying cemetery? It's cemetery. Arr. Again, nothing here. Oh, uh, if we go inside there, I'm sure I'm gonna get killed. What's this? Stranger, passing tell the world of us and say, Here at Corrin Cemetery lies by those 
What? Life by those who walk with their gods, bells, stuff rock. That makes no sense to me at all, so. Here lies our good friend Brian Munnetier. He was eaten by the by a ah, he What's was eaten by a scuffler. Dog? Cordalis can't resist showing off. Just like all the other rich fools, he built this grand structure in the midst of nowhere. Okay. Can we open it? Can we gray problem? I'm kind of scared that there's some something's going to come out. Oh fuck, I didn't, I didn't mean to go down. Fuck. Fuck. What's that? What's going on? There's like some weird texture pop up. There's a monster, level one. Can we get out of here? Was that an enemy? Oh shit. I think we can kill him. Yeah, we can kill him. This is definitely not the quest I'm doing though. I hope I don't die. I've gained experience. I'm so far from leveling up. There's an experience bar at the bottom, as far as I can tell. 32 experience. We can take finger. That's not a finger. Cotton. Cotton. I can use cotton, I guess. What this guy? Nothing. I don't know, I'm still confused as to where the little spider is. I'm gonna keep exploring to the southwest. That's definitely not a little spider. Level 1 turret. I should be able to kill it. There's more spiders, so I'm guessing it's this way. Can I kill this turret? Before it kills me? Another spider. Uh, the turret's gonna hit me. Fuck you, spider. I'll come for you later. Oh no, you're coming back, of course. Come on. Why are you doing this? Spider's like running away. Oh, you're fighting the tower. Run away. Holy shit. I almost died. What's that? A white widow's fang. Is that what we need? Tiny white spiders. I haven't ran by a tiny white spider. Come on, at least I want to get one quest done before. Holy shit, white widow spider. That's not tiny. That's... Not tiny at all. I mean, I'm gonna take a potion. Did I have something? Yeah, that's regenerating our health. Let's go for it. This might be the quest. It really only stuns us, so... And this is level 1, so... This might just be the quest. And it's going down pretty easy. Was that it? No. Practice. 
I don't know, I'm looking for a tiny white spider. I'm guessing if I ran into a big white spider that it's this is in the way. Uh, I'm hitting the 30 minute mark and I don't know what I'm doing. Cemetery, fortress, statue house, location, dragon statue, fountain, I don't know man. But I found the southeast of town. There's nothing here. Like all those monsters I killed, and look at my experience bar. <laughs> Doesn't seem like it's gonna be an easy game. Like, if I don't finish this quest, anyone watching this and has played this game, please tell me how to get to the little white spider please I'm gonna give it like five or ten more minutes looking for it if not I'm gonna give up until I can either find it I'm gonna give up until next video of course there's a normal spider here or is it's not coming back anymore no I mean, I'm, I don't want to look through a tutorial or walkthrough of the game, just because I don't like doing that. So... Maybe he just meant the southeast of town. He didn't mean outside. Maybe it was the spider that got inside the town. Could that be it? I don't know, let me read my quest. Tiny white spider, those monsters are the easiest you can find here. So easy you can defeat them. The one I need can be found southeast of the village outskirts. And that's, that's to the eastern gate. There's nothing next to the gate, so I'm just gonna go for that gate up north. I don't know, to me that gate I was in was the eastern gate. Unlock. What? Oh, to unlock chests, you need freaking runes. Can I? I don't know how this works. Yeah, I have no idea how that works. Why the hell do I need to unlock a crate? I have no idea, it's not like it's a chest. This is a northeastern gate. Like, if the monster I'm looking for is right here, I'm gonna be seriously pissed. Because this is not east, this is... There's spiders. Tiny white spider. Oh, uh, that pisses me off. Pisses me off that I gotta keep clicking and it's not auto-attacking. Another tiny white spider. Come on, just die. I don't know if that guy wants us to white widow's meat. I I don't I don't know what that guy wants. He did say southeast, so this is not southeast. This is north east. Those are definitely not spiders, and they're not level one. And I don't... Yeah, if they run away... Good deal. 
Use mining skills. Hey man, there's no tiny white spider out here. I'm sure this is east. That was a... I tried both gates, so... I'm gonna go talk to him. See if he wanted one of the items I got, like... The White Widow's fangs. I don't know. We'll see. Because we literally tried the two gates to the east. And neither one had the monster. The Temple of Velus the Beautiful, Goddess of Vitality. She's part of the Sacred Trinity of Perun and Sfarog. I must remember to make a sacrifice to her to renew life energy. I heard there are sacred sculptures of her scattered around the land. Okay, is that like human sacrifice? I don't want to make a human sacrifice. Um, what am, where am I going? I guess this is okay. I'm taking like an alternate route. Can I get through here? There's another shit I need to unlock. I don't know how to do this. Thank you game for explaining to me how to unlock items. Oh, let's look in this crate. Can't unlock it, so... I don't know what all these fucking bags are. Holy shit. <laughs> this game needs a tutorial, like... Most definitely. Am I even going the right way? Yeah. Let's face the east. I just noticed there's a compass up there. Yeah, east is that way. And I did go east, so... I don't know. Maybe that was it. Great. Your first Very good. That mission is done. Here's a recovery potion. Please take it. Okay, that's good. Ah, uh, hello, stranger. Welcome to Cordons. So I finished my quest. Okay, guys, I'm gonna finish it off there. Um. I'm gonna keep playing this game, keep recording this series. I hope you guys, uh, if anyone's watching, you can leave a comment, tell me what to do <laughs> if you played this game, like, give me some tips. Because I honestly don't know what the fuck is going on. Let's save game, new save. Let's save it. Yeah, new save game below news level 1. Okay, so we're gonna end it there. And thank you for watching. Please like, rate, subscribe. Even if you like it or if you like it, leave a good comment. If you don't like it, tell me what's wrong and how I can make it better. Anything helps. Until then, guys. Until next time. I mean, until next time. <laughs> uh, okay, let me try that again. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye.